Hey friends, I welcome you all on this Usatility channel. Now we can understand how to install the PKXD on PC. Therefore, we can enjoy with mouse and keyboard even on a big screen. No more need to stick your eyes on tiny display, but it is the time to try out PKXD on PC. Keep viewing the video so that you can not skip any step. Now we will do it. To install this specific game on laptop, we have provided a URL for you in the description of the video. To see the URL clearly, here it is. This link will take you to the page of PKXD in LD Player. LD Player is a software to install any Android game on a computer, and thus we are going to install PKXD using this method. It's an Android emulator that emulates tablets or Android mobile devices so we can use a mouse and keyboard, utilize a large screen, etc. We click on the Download PKXD for PC option, and then the download starts. Here it is, ldplayerinstaller.x. Touch on this specific file now. Windows 10 may ask for permission to proceed with the installation, only accept the conditions. I'm going to minimize the browser so that we can view the game installer much better. I am just going to choose the directory for the installation of the game. You may pick a custom directory by pressing the Customize the installation. As a way to move forward, click here on Install Now, and then installation will begin. It will just take a few MBs from the memory space of your PC to download this particular file. A good internet connection will better support downloading. Now it's going to proceed to install the emulator. The installation is done. This is the very first time it'll open LD Player, so it's going to make a few configurations that it is just going to do now, next time it's not going to take too long to launch. On your computer screen, the icons of LD Player, as well as LD Multiplayer, will appear. The first one is to launch LD Player. This particular part is vital. We click on System Apps, and then click on the Play Store icon. As a way to get access to Google Play, click on Sign In. Sign in, once more, and it will request us the credentials to sign in to Google Play. Signing into Google Play on this emulator is extremely easy. See you after this specific step. In this particular step, we are going to just log in to the Google account. Look, we've entered our Google account. To continue game installation, we accept the terms of use by clicking I agree. It asks for making a backup of the device within the cloud, but we don't require it, so we press, no. We accept it, and it'll quickly go to Google Play. Now we search, PKXD, on Google Play. Right after completing all of the crucial steps, we've finally reached the installation step. We will head to Google Play and then click on install. Installing the PKXD starts, it downloads the game. Speedier internet access is advised to complete the game download quickly, as it will take a couple of minutes to download, thus, I will cut this part in the video. See, I will start PKXD by hitting this particular icon. If we reboot the laptop, we click twice this Windows desktop icon, and the game will launch. Here's an option to customize the keyboard setup. Because we are not serious about customizing keyboard options, and we will leave them as it is. Would you like to enjoy the game on the big screen? If yes, then there are two methods. Look, here's how you can maximize the screen by maximizing the emulator. This option is just suitable for those who would like to get the big screen, however, not 100% full screen. Touch F11 to get 100% full screen and then touch precisely the same key to leave that mode. When you start playing the game in full screen mode, you will be able to better focus on the game. According to the power of your PC, PKXD could be more or less fluid, as this is an emulator and needs a lot of power. Now, I am going to explain how to change the game language. For this reason, you're supposed to select preferences. In the drop down menu, select the language you'd like. Look, this is the way we've altered the game language. The game has been eventually installed. It is ready to play. Don't forget to like the video and leave a comment. We will be happy to answer. Thanks a lot, buddies, for your time. I hope this video will be helpful for all of you.
Bye.